Hello everybody. So, we've been seeing a lot of videos lately about Republicans wanting to ban TikTok. What else is new, am I right? But here's the thing. Okay, I don't want it banned. Okay, just gonna get that out there right there. I don't want it banned. I love TikTok. I'm on this app every single day. <sighs> there are some problems with it that we didn't have before. Okay? Now, for, exa for example, I thought I was the only one. All right? My old, my phone is old. I was just, I need to get a new phone. The screen is cracking, all that kind of stuff. But when I'm using the app, right, I'm just scrolling as you do, and all of a sudden it'll stop responding. It's like, oh, you do have internet, but um, we're going to act like you don't. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm loading. Uh, nothing's happening. Oh, can't load the video. Crap. Oh. I thought I was the only one. And I talked to a few friends who use TikTok every day, just like I do, and they're like, yeah, I've noticed that too. I've been going through the same. So it's like, okay, TikTok fix your shit. Okay. Fix it. We, we love this app. We don't want to get frustrated by it. And I've been getting pretty frustrated by it lately. Another thing is they, TikTok is no longer pushing out videos the way it used to. If the video is worth watching, if enough people liked it within the first, I don't know, few hundred views, it would push it further. Cool. Right? I've seen a couple very popular creators, like ones that have like millions of followers complaining that their video is only getting a few hundred views, but an awful lot of likes and reposts and favorited and all that stuff, but it won't push past those first few hundred. I've experienced it myself. I'm not a big creator. I've got, you know, a relatively decent following, but there's one guy, I can't remember his name. There's, I was trying to think of the guy's name. I can't think of his name. He's got, I think it was like 3.2 million followers. And he goes, what are they following me for? What are they following me for? I should have at least half that number in every single one of my videos. And he goes, I've got a lot of people messaging me or in the comments saying, whoa, you still make videos? I, I, haven't, I haven't seen you in forever. It's been months. I've been posting every single day. And nobody knows I've been making videos. 3.2 million followers and nobody knows I'm making videos. I should be having like that much. 3.2 million views. Or at least half that for the people who are, aren't on this app every day. And I agree with him. It's like, if it's a good video, if it's getting attention, if it's getting traction, push it out. Why have you stopped? <sighs> I don't want the I don't want the app banned. I don't. But it's causing me an awful lot of frustration and I know I'm not the only one. So it's just like please TikTok just fix your app. I don't know what's going on with you but please fix it. I don't like getting frustrated by you. You are the voice of the people. If it wasn't for you, most of us wouldn't know what's going on in the world because freaking news companies don't cover that shit. <sighs> Like whenever um, a politician takes a massive bribe to, in order to not do something or to do something, we know about it. Why? Because of TikTok. Thank you, TikTok. Love your face. <laughs> uh, if there's a big natural disaster, it's affecting hundreds, if not thousands of people like drinking water. You know, they're suffering. They can't drink their water. They can't get any. You know, the government sends a little bit of water, but it's like enough for a bottle per person. We don't hear about it on the news. Oh, hell no, we don't hear about that on the news. We hear about it here on TikTok. So whenever, you know, I hear, you know, the Republicans saying, oh, well, I, we have to ban TikTok because, you know, it is poisoning the minds of... No, it's, it's, it's actually um, educating us on the poison that you're spewing, okay? But every time it frustrates me, every once in a while, I'm just like, just freaking ban the app. Just freaking ban it. Obviously, I don't mean that because I get frustrated easily and I, you know, I'm like, okay, no, I take that back. Like within the first minute, I'm just like, no, I take that back. I don't want the app banned. I just, I'm just so frustrated. You need to fix it. And it doesn't help that I just quit smoking again. That's right. I have had a lot of people messaging me saying, hey, did you, did, are you, are you still not smoking? No, I went back to smoking, but I'm quitting again. I'm back on the patch. <sighs> Go figure, every single time I quit smoking is usually the most stressful times in my life. But I'm not that stressed lately. So that's actually one reason why I started quitting smoking again, because I'm like, I'm not that stressed. I don't have a lot of stresses in my life, for once. But obviously, when it comes to quitting smoking, 
anything that mildly stresses you out, you're going to get a lot more stressed than you should be. So there's that. Um, I've been talking for over five minutes. I'm done for now. Love your face, and I hope this video gets pushed out to enough people who actually want to see this kind of video. Boop! <laughs>